District Attorney Pam Price has failed the people of the East Bay, and we are uniting to seek her recall from office. Congressman Eric Swalwell joining the call to recall Alameda County District Attorney Pamela Price. The cops catch and Price releases. Surrounded by the families of crime victims, the congressman accusing her of being too lenient. Violent robberies and burglaries and home invasion robberies continue to be on the rise. The district attorney defending herself Wednesday, saying the congressman should know better as a former deputy district attorney. He's parroting the same unfounded claims that we're not prosecuting, that we're releasing people. Price telling me several times she's disappointed in the congressman. Can you expand a little bit more on what to you is most disappointing? I think people expect our Congress people to listen to um, the constituents, to really do their research and, you know, to really weigh out what their position should be. The DA saying she invited the congressman to meet with her in August and that he didn't respond. I did give him that opportunity to come and meet with me and my executive leadership team so we could share with him what we have been doing um, in our first, you know, 18 months. DA Price didn't do her job and she continues not to do her job. Lori Mose is among the leaders of the recall charge. Her son Blake was shot and killed in a robbery while working security at a Home Depot in Pleasanton last year. Victims' families deserve a DA that will rally with them, support them, and charge proper. Yes. The DA acknowledging gun violence as the biggest threat in the county. I have been working over the last year uh, with law enforcement, with my team, to attack that um, and doing what we can. So we're doing our part. Congressman Swalwell is the first Alameda County House member to publicly take a stand on this recall effort. Tara Campbell, ABC7 News.